Now to a story the Target 12 investigators have been tracking for months. Chronic staffing issues at the Department of Human Services were under the microscope at a House Oversight Committee meeting that wrapped up moments ago. We've been reporting on problems at the agency, including long wait times for people seeking access to food stamps. Target 12 investigator Tolly Taylor joins us now. And Tolly, the hearing, it got heated at times. Yeah, that's right. Several state representatives uh, used their time to show their frustrations with DHS and told the interim director DHS should have seen the staffing shortage coming. In her second to last day on the job, Rhode Island Department of Human Services Interim Director Celia Blue facing a barrage of questions from lawmakers and often exasperation. Representative Edith Agello referencing news coverage from November. The wait time for people calling in to apply for SNAP was between two and three hours on hold. That was November 22nd. You tell us now that you've got it down below two hours? Still not where we need to be, and we, we, we accept, we, we admit that. Agello says she's frustrated hearing about long call wait times and people waiting months to get their federal supplemental nutrition assistance program benefits or SNAP benefits approved. Why didn't you see this coming? You know what the state hiring policies are. Blue says of the 974 staff positions at DHS, roughly 150 are vacant. And she says the state agency is especially focused on filling 71 open positions, positions that specifically help people with things like SNAP applications. DHS offices statewide were closed for most in-person services until mid-January, well after the DMV and DLT reopened for in-person services with reservations. We're in the early stages of those conversations. How come you guys are in the early stages when DMV is up and running and has been for well over a year. My understanding is that was the model they built years, uh, built years ago. The committee hearing raised a lot more questions than it answered, but Blue said DHS hopes to fill the 71 positions it's focused on over the next two months. With the Target 12 investigators, I'm Tolly Taylor, 12 News.